Today's health cast, the magic of music. Children with learning disabilities like autism or attention deficit disorder often have trouble focusing and that makes learning difficult. But our medical specialist Christy Kruger shows us a high tech tool that uses classical music to retrain the brain. <laughs> Your turn. 13 year old Donovan has an infectious grin, but his face really lights up when he's listening to music. That's a taste of the beautiful music Donovan hears through this special headset. The device also has a bone conductor that sends vibrations into his inner ear. It's called the Integrative Listening System, or ILS, and it's designed to gently stimulate and activate the brain. Which will help with any performance, with getting dressed in the morning, school performance, uh, being able to play, interacting with their peers. Donovan has cerebral palsy, but therapists say this listening system can help kids with any kind of learning disability. Get a green one. The programs are customized, those musical vibrations helping the brain and body communicate better. And that brain sends out the signals to the body, which puts the child in a better state to learn and function um, through helping them with attention, motor planning, the sensory processing. He was not able to multitask. With the music program, he's able to sit down, stay on task. I know, your turn. And he's able to do different things while he's listening to the music. This new music therapy isn't just for the classroom. It also works great at playtime, helping these kids with their body awareness, their coordination, and their balance. <laughs> Donovan has been using the ILS for 10 months, and his grandmother says the results are dramatic. Since he started here, there has been tremendous improvement, even his behavior as well. It has helped him tremendously. <laughs> And the ILS is not a new therapy, but there is growing evidence that our brains can be rewired and can work more efficiently with specific and repeated stimulation like the music Donovan was hearing and feeling in his head.